Hi everyone, my name is Vanessa Ferran. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back if you already subscribed and if you're not, I'd appreciate it if you can click on that subscribe button. It would help me a lot. But today we are going to straighten my hair. I know, shocker. Um, I am traveling tomorrow to Miami to see my family for the holidays. I'm taking Basil. Come on, Basil, say hi. He, he just entered a room. I'm taking Basil and it's his first trip or his first time in an airplane and he has really bad anxiety. So I just don't wanna have to deal with my hair because I wanna be just 100% focused um, on him. He's so sweet. Uh, and I am nervous because I'm gonna be by myself without my husband, Orlando, and usually like, I don't know, it's like the first time that I'm taking my child uh, without his dad and I feel the pressure of him being okay because his anxiety is off there. Like he's medicated, but it doesn't work as much as we wish. As I was saying, I'm going to straighten my hair with this new straightening iron that I got. Um, dry Bar Reserve Vibrating Styling Iron. I haven't bought a straightening iron in like five, six years. I did straighten my hair a couple of times with the brushes. It just wouldn't get to my root because yeah, like, yeah. I, mm, I'm gonna do this with you guys today. It vibrates. So I'm very excited to share this journey with you guys because this is completely new for me. But before we start with that process, I want to say thank you to our sponsor for today, Ana Luisa. As you guys know, I love this brand and not just the products, but also the ethos behind it. Um, I'm wearing all Ana Luisa out, uh, my earrings, my necklaces. Again, best jewelry company, honestly, that, I've, that I know of. I love this company. Not only that, but I'm also seeing my mom tomorrow and, but I should not show you my address. <laughs> I'm seeing my mom tomorrow and her Christmas present arrived. I'm gonna share it with you guys. On, and I also got some goodies for me from their November sale. Ugh, the sale was so good. But if y'all didn't get anything, don't worry. They're having the end of the year sale. So you can still get some last chance items for up to 60% off. I'm gonna leave the link down below if you wanna check them out. And again, I love this company because they are carbon and water neutral. They produce small batches, so they don't have much waste. And the pieces are so high quality, y'all. I've gotten other jewelry as presents and I forget that Annalisa's quality is like really high. So I use perfume with other pieces and I'm like, ooh, that one lasted for one time. But I got for my birthday, uh, for my best friend, she got me like a travel case for jewelry because she knows how much I love Annalisa. And my collection was growing so much that I was stressing out because every time I had to travel, I didn't have a big enough case to put them. This is a slim one and it's one of my favorite pieces because it's very dainty and I love this one. It's a very statement piece. I love it. I am obsessed with the pieces. But let me show you what I got for my mom. So these are the Octo Small Earrings. I think they're really cool and they are like very, very um like statement pieces. The one that I got for my mom, they're very dainty. These are the Susan and they have like a privé, like a pave. These I got for myself. Honestly, I've seen these everywhere and Somebody gifted me like a similar one and y'all it was like really bad quality so I needed one from Ana Luisa because they're like such a statement piece now that everybody was wearing them right now. This is called Ina and it's just such a classic piece. I love it. I'm gonna leave the link down below so you can check them out and you can snatch some pieces before they sell out because they will. Just check them out and see what you like. But let's start with my hair because uh, it's gonna be a long process because your girl has a lot, a lot of hair. Okay, so let's start with what or how I wash my hair because since I am a wavy curly, it means that depending on the product that I use, my hair and my curls are gonna either like fall down or get more curly texture. I love Brioche's Don't Despair Repair line whenever I'm going to straighten my hair because it is so moisturizing. It kills all the frizz that I have. So like, there's no way my curls honestly pop. They just fall down. I left my hair air dry, honestly, in the, in the, in the cold, really, because I was running errands and I didn't have time to blow dry my hair. And I just, this is how my hair looks with no product at all, besides, you know, like the leave-in and the heat protectant. Since that is done and my hair is already dry, I'm going to section it and I'm gonna brush it, which is something that nobody wants to see. I'm gonna take my jacket off because I'm gonna be doing some movements with my hand, and I'm gonna separate my hair from the middle, just because I have a lot of hair, and I love these big, massive scrunchies. I'm gonna look really cute here. Ta-da, gorgeous. Funny enough, I actually had this prep rally in my um, beauty counter, 
uh, and I just I'm like oh well dry bar dry bar let's use them together I'm gonna shake it up because it says that some of the conditioning ingredients in pep rally can sometimes rise to the top so yeah shake it up this is already um, separated so I'm gonna apply a little bit to my hair yeah this is a heat protectant prime and prep detangler I'm gonna go ahead with a comb. I'm going to detangle it. Now I know that some of y'all don't wanna see this part where I detangle my hair. I promise I'm gonna do it gently and with love so I don't have any breakage from the detangling sash because some people say you should not brush your hair. Curly girls don't brush their hair while it's dry. So that's what happens. It's okay, it's okay be fine i'm going to connect this baby oh, that mistake it's so pretty too it's just white and silver and kind of like translucent it's very shiny i love it and i have no idea i did not read the instructions because i don't have time because the light the sun is coming down so turn it on let's see i'm gonna turn it on yeah. so three little lights came in oh and it's getting four i'm gonna put it to like it's second to most hot the design of this Flat iron is so cute. Ooh, ooh, and look. It, it does vibrate and it sounds. I wonder, what is this like little? Oh, and you can take it off. So it has like three buttons. I can't, sh I mean, I'll show you here. So this one is the one that um, you can like make it hotter or less hot, like cooler. <laughs> and then this one is the one that you can uh, take off or put the vibration and then this one is the one here is the one that you can just turn it off or turn it on but it's cool because now it doesn't vibrate but then oh wait oh oh cool the vibration is for it to give you like the perfect amount of tension so that it doesn't pull your hair i'm gonna put it back on because because usually and in the past when i had like the old straightened iron like they would pull my hair so much that it would break Let's start with this. Do you think this is, a, yeah, I'm gonna do like a two inch, like a one inch piece because usually you have a lot of hair. So I'm gonna put it like that. Okay, three. Ooh, there's some smoke again. It was a little humid. Okay, oh, I so this part, I, I missed it because I put it in the outside part, like it was like here. I got, it got not, it didn't fit in like the plates. But I mean, we can compare like the difference of the part that did not fit in the plates and the part that did fit in the plates. Let me just do the whole thing. The little piece that did not. Yeah, I don't know if you can see the smoke because again, my hair is still a little damp from the heat protectant. I'm gonna use this brush and I think I'm gonna do it again because it was not, okay, let's see. I mean, it's not bad. I'm gonna try to do my hair in just two passes and see how it looks because I don't wanna overpass it too much because then, that's gonna damage it. Okay, one, two, three. I do like the fact that all trading irons will like stick and like tug a little bit and this one does not. Again, I guess it gives me the perfect tension. I usually start from the back to the front, but I wanted to show you guys like how, you know, like the difference and how it will like look. I'm gonna continue it from the back around. By the way, have you heard Adele's new album? Like it is off the charts. I am so obsessed with Adele. And I know like everybody's obsessed with like Taylor Swift and all too well version, but like I am more, you know, connected with, uh, I'm gonna use the, the comb, like it's better. I am more connected with, um, with Adele. Like I know, I just feel like Taylor Swift talks more about like young relationships, which honestly I'd never had because like I dated, I started dating when I was like 20. And when I started dating, I was dating like older men, not like 40 year old men, just like a couple of years older, like, they were like 25, 26. So I relate more to like more adult relationships. And I think like Adele and and Taylor Swift are the same age. I feel like Adele's voice is more soulful and it's just like more melancholy. I don't know, like it just makes you think about what you did wrong in life and what sometimes when you break up, it's not all you, other people's fault. Like you have some fault in it too. Taylor Swift is more like you did this, you did that and you know, and it's your fault whether like Adele is like, making peace with what happened in the past and just like moving on and like i'm gonna do the whole thing just like moving on and like becoming a better person i guess and like let me know down below which one's your favorite between like adele and taylor swift i know like adele definitely like will get me in the mood of like thinking about the past and my relationships and 
what went wrong and what was my fault, what was other people's fault. And yeah, it's a very therapeutic experience listening to Adele's new album. Okay. <laughs> Okay, obviously my ends are not the healthiest and you know what this means, a haircut is coming soon. I'm actually gonna, like after, you know, my hair, before I wash my hair, I'm gonna cut it straight because it's always easier. I mean, you guys know that I like to cut my hair curly, but if it's straight, it's just easier to cut it. Um, yeah, yeah, it's it's dead, y'all. It's dead, I know, it's my fault. I'm gonna secure this side up with a ponytail and now this straightening iron also allows you to curl your hair, which, Honestly, like for this pricing, like if you're gonna get it, just you know, ideally it would be to like do both, right? I never really use a curling iron because like my hair is already curly. What's the point, right? To use heat to make it more curly. Uh, I'm just going to show you guys how you can curl it if that's what you want to do. I'm gonna show you and show myself too because honestly, I've never done it. Okay, let's see. So I saw a tutorial, okay? So pretty much we have a little piece right here. So it is around the thing and then, but then my hair is so short, okay. So around the thing, the whole thing, and then this little part in the middle. But then, wait, I think I should have started like more on top, but well, here it goes. Here goes nothing. Oh my god, it's so cute! I think, I think it's so cute. Okay, so yeah, you can actually, you can tell, oh, this is really pretty. <gasps> Y'all, it's so pretty, look at that. Look at that, it is so cute. It is so cute. Okay, I should have started from like the up top part, but like if you like your hair, like we you know like they do like the little, from the middle to like the end, and then you just pretty much like, like this. I think it's really cool, I think. Okay, well, that was not cute, but I don't wanna do this look, so I'm gonna go ahead again and just straighten that out. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna turn that again. Let's see if I can actually get it back to where it was before. There we go, better. I mean, it is. it was very bouncy. I mean, it still has like a little bit of a curl, but <laughs> oh well, at least I show you. It'll, we'll figure it out later. Anyways, I'm, go I'm sure you don't wanna hear my dog barking. I'm gonna do this off camera since I already show you guys half of it. So I'll be back in a little bit when my whole hair matches. So I just finished my hair. I mean, I I always like seeing my hair straight. I mean, it's like a huge change. Like, oh, who is this? Who is this? You know, like a new whole different person. Okay, I am going to, damn, these highlights really to get retouched. I don't really care when they're like curly, but you can totally see the difference when they're, it's straight. This was like the curl that I did and it didn't go back. <laughs> it didn't go back. Um, like look at that look at that yeah like those ends need to go i need like this to be treated which i will do my final thoughts about that dry bar reserve vibrating straighten iron i mean i think it looks gorgeous like aesthetics 10 out of 10 speed of getting hot it was awesome you know 9 out of 10 i guess because i've had faster ones but i mean what five seconds extra that's nothing the only thing that i saw that you know was a little bit like hard for me was that it is so long like this whole thing is so long the whole barrel is so long however the plate oh i burned myself the plate is like half of it and i wish it was a little longer because it would be easier to get bigger sections and i caught myself like straightening it a lot of times i would just look like for example like start like a big piece and it's off by the way 
So I like a big piece and I would do like this, like in the middle. And if you can see, like half of that is not barrel anymore. So I would do like this and then half of it would be not straight. That's the only thing that I mean, I guess it takes time to get used to the barrel being not, the barrel not being as long. But I did notice that it wouldn't tug on my hair. Usually like those plates like tug on my hair, even though I do use like this to help it, you know, get straighter before the barrel goes through i still do think it's a little bit pricey but the curl that y'all I, I tried and it's still wavy so i love that like that if you want to have like curly ends this is the perfect tool to do so i mean look at my hair it looks shiny it is i mean if we don't look at the ends because the ends are a little rough it's pretty good now i'm going to use um this remilia a uh, hair they're like daily hair serum these capsules are so good. They leave my hair so soft. You open it like this, you twist it around. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Squeeze it, and then I'm gonna pretty much like mid to end because it's the part that it's so much drier. First, and then just continuing all the way. I love this because it's not heavy on my hair. It doesn't like make it oily. I know I'm obsessed with this serum. I love it, and I love it in my curly and my um, straight hair. Oh, this is so it smells so good too. Look at that. Like it's not. Like it's just. It still needs a haircut, but it looks so much better now, right? When your hair doesn't fit in the whole shot. Okay. So that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks so much for being with me while I straighten my hair. I'm gonna leave Anna Luisa's link down below so you can check it out and snatch some of those last chance items for up to 60% off or if you just wanna get at 10% off your whole order and you are filled with joy, peace, and happiness this season. I'll see you next time. Love you, bye.